If you think things cannot possibly get worse, trust me, they can and they will if we don't make a change in this election. I'm Kristen Urquiza. I'm one of the many who has lost a loved one to COVID. My dad was a healthy 65-year-old. His only pre-existing condition was trusting Donald Trump, and for that, he paid with his life. And unity. It's a fitting legacy for our brother, but George should be alive today. Breonna Taylor should be alive today. Ahmaud Arbery should be alive today. It was here that just weeks ago, Americans donned face masks and safely and peacefully protested the death of George Floyd. Good evening. Our great nation is now living in an unprecedented moment. We're facing the worst public health crisis in 100 years and the worst economic collapse since the Great Depression. We must come together, defeat Donald Trump, and elect Joe Biden and Kamala Harris as our next president and vice president. Sadly, this is the America that is on display for the next generation. A nation that's underperforming not simply on matters of policy, but on matters of character. Donald Trump is the wrong president for our country. He has had more than enough time to prove that he can do the job, but he is clearly in over his head. 